All right, so today I am going to show you how to do a sorting activity with your child. So what we're going to do is we're going to teach the child how to group different objects by color. Um, so here are the materials that you'll need for your sorting activity. So we're going to do it by color. So you're going to need objects of three different colors. So I have some blue, some red, <laughs> some red, and some yellow. Okay. Let me get the one that just flew across the room. Um, and then what you'll also need is something that your child can put these objects on. So I'm just using blank pieces of paper. So I have three pieces of paper. You can use a cup, you can use bowls, um, plates, anything like that. It's just a place so the kid knows where to put the object. So you need your color items and your places where we can do the sorting. Um, then you're going to put one of each color on each, well, one color on each paper. So you're gonna do a blue, a red, and a yellow. And this is so your child knows where to sort each color. So blue goes here, red goes here, yellow goes here. So the other thing that you're going to need is some type of reinforcer. That is just something that your child loves or wants to play with, likes to eat. It could be like a little M&M or a fruit snack. Um, your child could work for like praise and high fives. It really depends on your child. Um, so any type of toy that they want, things like that. So what you're going to do is I would recommend holding the objects and giving your child one at a time. So you're gonna hold the objects. Your child will be sitting in front of these papers with one color on each paper. The direction that we're going to give your child is sort. So you're going to give them one item and you're going to say sort. And what they'll do is they'll take the item and put it with the correct color. So blue goes with blue, okay? So I'm gonna give you an example of what it should look like when your child gets the answer correct, and then what it will look like when your child gets an answer incorrect. Okay, so here's correct first. So you're going to present the item, give the direction, say sort. Your child's gonna take the item, put it with the color. If they do it correctly, you give them praise. Great job, that was awesome sorting, you're super. You put red with red, nice going. And then you can also follow that with the reinforcer, such as a toy or again, like a fruit snack. Um, but you don't have to give those items every time, just praise every time for sure. Um, so if your child gets the answer incorrect, so let's say we say, give them the item, give them the direction, sort, they pick it up and they put it on the wrong color. So we never try to say like, no, or that's not right or anything like that. So we, I wouldn't say anything. All you're gonna do is you're gonna take the item off, you're gonna give it back to your kid, say sort, and then with your hand on top of their hand, you're gonna guide them to the correct color. And then you can just say something like, yep, that's sorting yellow. And then you can give them another try. So take it off again, say sort, and then they can try again. So if they get it correct, again, you're gonna be like, woohoo, that was awesome, great job, you sorted yellow. Um, if they get it incorrect, so you say sort, they get it incorrect, you're gonna take it off, give it to them, say sort, put your hand over their hand, say that's sorting yellow, and then let them try again. Um, okay, so I'll just show you a couple more uh, correct responses. So sort, yeah, great job, that was sorting super cool, you're a rock star. Sort, nice sorting yellow, that was super cool. And then you'll just keep going Sort until all the items are finished. Sort. Yeah, nice job. You sorted all the items, super cool. Um, and that is what a sorting activity could look like. Um, some other things you can sort, you can sort any object you can find by color. That's super easy. Um, and you can ask me about different things that your child can sort. Uh, some other examples could be silverware, um, like forks, spoons, and knives is really good. Um, you can also sort like animals if you have some toy animals. So you could do like elephants, sharks, and cats, uh, things like that. So if you have any questions, let me know. And um, if you try any sorting activities with your kids, definitely take pictures and send them to me because I would love to see them. All right. Have a good day, everybody. See you later.